Information is created, information is stored, information is organized, information is displayed, and it stays in that display stage for a long time. You know, as long as your profile is available on Facebook, your profile is being displayed, even if you no longer update it. And by the way, if you update it, it's kind of going through that same cycle again, right? It's being new creation, being stored again inside of your database record, your, um, your information item inside of Facebook, and it's being displayed. And then finally, at some point in time, maybe in the very distant future, an information item is retired. It's retired in one of two ways. It's either deleted or it's archived. If it's deleted, it's gone poof. If it's archived, it's moved off to the side for possible later use of some sort, right? So on your hard drive, you can hit the delete button and that means it's gone good, good goodbye. I never want to see it again. Um, and then you can move it off to some other folder where you, know, you don't have to look at it, but it's still there if you really need it. That's, that's um, archiving it. On Facebook, you have both of those options. You can archive your, pro your profile, which, is, which says um, uh, retire. They, it's like make it inactive, I think they call it on Facebook. Inactivate my profile, which means it's still there waiting. And if you come back later, you can activate it again. But it won't show up in any displays. That's the idea, right? It's taken out of service. Active information is being displayed all the time. Inactive information or retired information is off to the side. If I want to display it, I can ch make it active again, or I can just keep it in retirement forever. That's what Facebook would hope that you do so that they can continue using your information even though you're not displaying it anymore. But Facebook now does have the option, didn't always have the option, but it does have the option now to completely delete your information. Facebook gave you that option because people got really mad. How dare you not allow me to get rid of my profile? How dare you keep stuff around when it's deleted? I want to end this segment about the life cycle with just one more note about deletion. When is something really, really, really deleted? The answer is maybe never. And if it ever is, you're not going to know that it was ever completely deleted. So give me, let me give you this example and show you how deletion is in the eye of the beholder. So I go to Facebook and I say, delete my profile. And I click OK, I go through all the things, you sure, are you absolutely sure, are you totally absolutely sure, don't, you know, this will never come back again. I say yes, 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 delete, 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 delete. I go about my merry way after that thinking, OK, done with that. Everything I ever put on Facebook is now gone and goodbye kapoof. Well, not exactly. First of all, just because you said delete on that page doesn't mean it immediately gets out of all the Facebook systems. Facebook does, I'm, I'm assured, their best to delete it eventually from everywhere that it exists on Facebook, but that takes a while, right? There's all the Facebook backups, there's all the different places where it resides. It really takes a while for that deletion to move its way through the system so that Facebook says, okay, finally gone, as far as we know, that profile is deleted. But somebody, when I, you know, somebody yesterday before I deleted my profile, I downloaded one of the pictures that I put on Facebook. Now, Facebook can't delete their download of it. Not only did they download it, but they posted it on Flickr, right? And now it's in the Flickr system. And you get my idea, right? Stuff can easily proliferate from one place to another. Or some application that, um, uh, that was running on Facebook, Farmville or something else, right? Gets a hold of your user information and they do something with your information and they put it in their servers and maybe according to their contract with Facebook, they have to delete it, maybe they don't. Maybe they say they delete it, but they forget. Maybe they say they delete it, but they really don't want to. Maybe they say they delete it, but their deletions aren't exactly as good as they think they are. Maybe they went ahead and sold your information a long time ago to somebody else. You see what I'm getting at, right? You hit the delete button, but you don't know where it was in the first place before you, tried, you said you were going to delete it. So you have no possibility of knowing exactly when it's going to be deleted. Understand that about retirement. Understand that just because you think it's retired or deleted, it's not necessarily.